How's it going, folks? Hope you're all having a good night. Picking up right where we left off because I'm not even sleeping. I'm enjoying this game too much. Wilson, you have a gun for me. All right, let's see what you got. What I like to hear. Oh, is that it? That is garbage. Okay. Why am I walking so slow? What's wrong with me? Oh my god, like I can't move any faster. Oh. Why is this even a mechanic? Why am I encumbered? How do I sell? No! That was my big gun! Okay. Phew. New gun owner, I hope. Either you go now, or there will be blood! What the fuck? What is despawned? Okay, I'm 2k short. Someone in this tower go cuckoo again? This is a private matter, so just move along. Wait, he might know Barry. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Patrona. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Did you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? It's not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just... be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be... touchy. Let's see what I can do. Hey, Barry! Everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as a yes. Uh, try again later. Well, you know, Barry, I can skip time.
Barry, am I remembering that right? Who is it? V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a golf thing like that. You gave me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. I remember. What do you want? I just want to see what was shaking. Friends say you never leave your unit. Think I've got an inkling as to why. I've seen that look before. It's all too common among people like us. Us? <laughs> you don't look like a cop. Badges don't get them up. Then you get used to it, of course. Until it hits someone you're close to. You too. Come in. If you close the door, it wasn't very inviting, Barry. I lost someone close to me too. A damn good friend. What do you mean, too? Wait. It's about Andrew. They, uh, told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? And Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. But well, you told him about Andrew. Honestly, I thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive? If he felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am. Um, I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care. Am I getting paid to be a counselor? <laughs> it's you. You talk to Barry? He finally decided to get his shit together. I cry out loud, Mendez. We had a little chat. He seems chilled, but seriously down in the dumps. He's got a bone to pick with Mendez. What? So why doesn't he say so to my face? Clearly he couldn't stand his job and didn't have anyone to talk to about it. He said you didn't even try to understand him. See? Was I right? <sighs> Give me a break. Barry likes playing the drama queen. You just gotta shake some sense into him, trust me. We'll see. We'll have to check in on him later. Thanks for your help. This is for your trouble. That does nothing. You paid me in peanuts. Oh man, 21,000. Victor, please. No cyber psychos here.
It says dangerous, but maybe it's all dangerous. Run in the tens of trillions of euro dollars. The shop. I hate this elevator. What's up? Doing a little competition. Shoot, prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. <laughs> yeah, that it makes sense. Well, you in? Sure, I'm in. When? Well, uh, right now. We'll wait on you. See ya. I just left. I could have done it this whole time before. Take a fucking walk. June, fuck off! Or I implant my blade in your ribs! Really? Wonder what Mama Wells would say. What she'd do when she sees you two gonks fucking up her joint. My bet she'd whip out her shotgun and blast your heads off. Hey, right, come on, baby. That work. That work out. Yo, fuck you! Carajo! Fucking punk! What? What just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up. God damn, sorry. I, I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because you look like you got some eds on you. I see. Nothing for free. Not in this goddamn city. Not in this goddamn life. Hey, Here, cool. all I got. The rest, bartender got the rest. I made my quota. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. 
Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in here. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you then? On the house. Never say no, say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Feel up up Ten there. years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Base solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, right? Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. Damn sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Wait. But today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And, uh, hmm. She had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night, she wasn't even there. Signs that? Well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Why you wanna know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gunk question is that? Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. Breaking up a happy marriage. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. It means a lot to me. No, V. V, you never learn, do you? Oh, is it chat time? Oh, come on, hit me with those pearls of wit. Got somewhere else to be. Um. Sure, Johnny. Hey, Kirk. Been a while. V? Holy shit! Barely recognize you. I see you haven't changed. Not a single bit. Huh. Well, you know me? I'm old-fashioned like that. Slow and steady wins the race, huh? So come on, sit down. I'll spill you the deets. Start talking. All right, all right. Listen, job's simple. Got a van standing not far from here, brimming with merch worth fat digits. Driving to the border tomorrow, but a lot of things could happen before then. You feel me? Specifics, Kirk. What's in the van? Militech implants. Experimental series. Shit you can't get on the street. Straight out of some lab in Shanghai. And who does it belong to? Jesus, V, who the fuck cares? Once we take it, it's ours. So, can I count on you or not? Sounds too good to be true. Oh, fuck it. It's worth a shot, at least. Count me in. Oh, it's true, all right. Anyways, send you the cohorts. See you at the spot. Later. Well, I hope I get an impact. What do I need to use that big gun? Can I equip it anyway? CD bars, betrayal, a beguiling woman. Sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story. An unfaithful wife 
In a city where everything is uncertain. Too bad done. Trying to focus. Since I arrived on the scene, looking right for the woman alone. in the pink jacket. Call me the L woman Kennedy. with a sorted and they call you. Stop right there. See, no introductions necessary. I already took care of that. If someone comes to me with beers, I take care of it. I eat, sleep, and breathe beers. Remember that. Aye, aye, Captain. While we're at it, you need fresh wheels, bikes, I got it all. Real good prices. So hit me up anytime, you hear? I guess we're going broke now because both side missions quit on me. I'm sorry, is the, the, the map just broken? Is that a damn CD project red? Sure, Ubisoft or EA didn't make this game in this one year and a half, but it's still kind of lost it. Got the scratch. Got the cred for the helmet job. Fine. Anders Hellman, flip me the deeds. Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Cheers, Claire. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Let's see what you got.
Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway, but he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Probably keeping him hidden from Arasaka. Must have worked on a top secret project. Mm-hmm. Hidden from Arasaka or any other megacorp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table. But catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. So a native? Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her and not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nabin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Uh, finally. All clear. Let's get out Thanks. Of here. Good luck. Let's go. Did you catch anything? Hang on just a little longer, Chuk. Reaper's on the way. Forget something? Fuck. Come on. Why not be at the hospital? Come on. Something it's Pan Am? What do you mean you're coming? Be coming, dog. You'll be here in five minutes. Better. How did you even get Fuck. this number? From Rogue. Oh, uh, great. Fuck. Where's that old war horse want to kick me now? This thing between you and Rogue, couldn't care less. I got a job for you. Good. But I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch and your car, getting them back, I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street, the one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. Rail freight yard. Nice place for an hour finish.
Pan Am? So you're a V. Where's my car? <laughs> Agree to help me, you'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Fuck me, you always on the warpath? Only when someone tries to jerk me around. Where the hell is my car? I tell you, and then what? Gonna storm off, handle it all by yourself? No concern of yours. None. Listen to me. Listen to me. You need my help. And you'll get it. I mean that. Right after we solve my problem. Fine. Say it. What do you want? Need to hit a Kang Tao transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamned mind? About you or the job. Kang Tao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, inform your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirty bastard. I will strangle you. Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz! Hey! Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Buzz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz? Vista Del Rey, Boz. Had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values. A strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. Gave that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. So, where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. 
That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Good, let's roll. Get in. Go, go, go. Where'd you get the ride? Straight out of some driveway in Rancho? Yes, exactly. Is that a problem? For me? No, not at all. I mean, there's no accounting for taste. Screw you. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue, do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Guess you'll have to ask her yourself. Oh, I'll be sure to. I'll especially ask why she told me to work with Nash, yet forgot to mention he was Raffin. I not have known that side of him. So make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in her game. Her plan. That's it. Rogue's a frigid old bitch. That's the truth. Look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm -hmm. Who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Well, I want this spin on the thing. The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear. Then be out of your hair. Where can I get one of these? Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Is that a rocket launcher? No. It's a rifle. I want it. Give it Will to you me. help me with this? What's inside? 
A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure out your differences with Sol? Will you come back? Panam, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. God, this is so slow. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Less talking, more shooty. Please. Okay. We have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first. To look for anything that might be useful. Doubt Rocky Ridge could be any deader. Everything down. Well, have Nothing you found works anything? here. No dice. Nothing's well, we'll up. Make it work. All cut off. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? So, classic route. Good old diversion. You know it. First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First, we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substance. I'll bring the car around. Uh huh. Oh, I realize I can't sprint with that thing. looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery.
Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Now we wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. How do I even do it? Listen, son of a bitch, Buzz. You, wait for him here. Get good and ready. The show starts. Now! Let there be light. I don't really feel like Move. I'll take the wheel. There. Couldn't wait another minute, could you? At last. Well. She's prime wheels, isn't she? Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. 
The fucker didn't show. Pan Am. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got him. Six Street away for Just listen to I... me, for fuck's sake! I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. And Nash Hunt wasn't part of our deal. Only because I thought he would show up in Rocky Ridge. But he didn't. Might not even be in their hideout. I know he's there, V. That fucking Raffin cheated me. I can't just let it go. I can't. Do you really not understand that? No. Not what we agreed. Are you joking? Tell me you are, please. Not about to risk everything to settle a score that isn't even mine. You don't get it. This is more than no, just... No, Pan Am. Mash made a fool of you, I get it. But don't try and make one out of me. We hand the goods off to 6th Street, then set up the helm and grab. That was our deal. That was our deal. Where's the meetup with 6th Street? Really, you're gonna get all pouty on me now? Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Pan Am. Stop it. You pouting like some wounded puppy. Shut up. Why? Aim not to talk for the rest of this thing? I could have gotten him. He was right there. We could have gotten him. There'll be chances. Right now we got more pressing things in our list. So get your shit together or tell me you're out. Now. I promise to help. I'll help. Just give me a minute, all right? They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Hey, boss. Panna! How's Nash? Doesn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Uh huh. So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll! Hello, Rogue. Come out. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? I got the merch and the car back. Sixth Street is happy. That's two shits cleaned, bitch. Which means you'll get your cut after all. I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched by your concern. Till the next one, Pan Am. What Fuck. bitter cold bitch that broke? Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she was once sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. I need a drink now. Come on. We'll get one. In good time. Unfortunately, we're out of it for this episode, folks. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. If you're interested in the continuation of this series, consider subscribing. But in the meantime, have a good one.